My name is Rebecca Westrate, and I'm the principal at Hamtramck High School, and I am September superhero. Even when she first came to the school, everything was very natural with her. You didn't have to try to like her uh, or communicate with her. And she seemed in awe of like, all that's going on. After she came back, everything shifted. Like The students, they wanted to listen to her. It was kind of like we all were in her, like she hypnotized us or something, but we were just so, she, was, she motivated us kind of to do better. I mean, I feel like so much about building a relationship is um, this kind of, this duality of holding them accountable and allowing them freedom. And that's what, I mean, that's one thing that all teenagers crave. And again, that's what, the one thing that helps us prove ourselves as an adult. In the March of my senior year, we had the chance to go to States for Student Council, which was up in Traverse City. And for one of the days, she actually drove up there by herself to be there with us. To see her actually be there was like, oh, we're doing something right. And, you know, we're doing something better for the school. And she actually noticed. And it was really nice of her just to be up there. When we first asked her about the prom, she was all for it. You know, when they came to me, honestly, there wasn't a question in my mind that we needed to do that because it was so important to them and that they really deserve that experience that they were craving. They could say very clearly, you know, we want to um, respect the traditions that we have in our families and how we've been brought up. And in, in the same way, we're exploring our identities as young Americans. And this is a way that we can do both of those things. So after the whole entire night, it felt like just a girl's night out. And I really liked it, that whole entire idea. And a lot of girls didn't think it would be all that successful. But when they actually came to the event, it actually turned out really well. And it was just a dream come true. We just had an amazing time. I remember the girls um, would come in and they would go and they would take off all of their wraps and they would be, you know, in their beautiful dresses. And lots of girls, you know, we had never, we had never seen. I, I, a lot of girls, I didn't even know what color hair they had. It was like the weekend after um, prom and we were getting a lot of media speculation from you know people online, bloggers and everything. Miss Westray gave me probably the best advice and she told me that she knows that everything is stressing me out and that everything about that night was beautiful. And I can't let people that didn't weren't there at the prom and don't know the context of it stress me out. And I could either focus on the beautiful or I can focus on the ugly and be scared by it. And she told me to choose the beautiful and to move forward. And that's exactly what I did. And she told me that she was proud of me. And if that's not motivation and devotion, then I don't know what is. <laughs> I mean, I get as much out of it as they do. And I think maybe that's the thing, is just really being in the moment with them and giving yourself to them in that moment. And you know, that's what keeps me going. That's why I do this job.